Hey guys, what's up, Christy here, and today I'm bringing you guys video on whether, well, not whether, but my thoughts and ideas of uh, competitive Call of Duty switching over to PlayStation. Now, one thing to keep in mind, um, competitive will always be on Xbox, will always be on, I'm not sure, I uh, can't speak, but not that sure about PC, but competitive will always be with Xbox, like, if for those of you that just bought an Xbox, don't be scared. Competitive COD on Xbox is still going to be pretty big. So anyways, what does this mean? Like, why is competitive COD switching over the PlayStation? So for those of you that don't know, um, Xbox's, uh, you know, agreement with, uh, well, I'm going to say PlayStation, but Call of Duty, um, has come to an end for Advanced Warfare. And for Black Ops 3, you know, anyone could buy it out now, like pretty much the highest bidder. And of course, PlayStation was the highest bidder. So what this means is that at tournaments, um, it's just going to be PlayStation shoes, uh, lands, all that. A lot of big, um, you know, it's going to be more populated on Twitter tourneys, I feel, and all this stuff. But honestly, I still feel like... Um, it's really going to be on Xbox still, a majority of it at least. I know there are a lot of pros, there's really top amateur teams, semi-pro and pro teams are all switching over. But, um, I mean, it's going to be hard to get used to if you're switching over, but if you guys are still on Xbox, going to stand there, I wouldn't be worried because there's still going to be a lot of competitive, like, Twitter tourneys, there's still going to be UMG, MLG, um, there's always gonna be that, um, and that's pretty much it, I mean, there, it, it is gonna be a big change, it, we're not gonna be used to, um, you know, competitive COD being on PlayStation, so now lands, um, it's gonna be hard, you know, because you would have to buy a PlayStation controller, and if you wanna stay cheap and just go wing it playing on PlayStation, it's gonna be a bit hard, um, also, like, it's just hard if you want to start doing competitive and you buy an Xbox One because both consoles did come out a year ago. Um, competitive COD was on Xbox, so it's very hard, like especially now because if you want to be on top of the line for um, you know competitive, you have to have a PS4. And I won't say have to have, but if you're going to lands and stuff, you obviously need to practice on a PS4 and. That's honestly the only problem I feel like everything else competitive COD like Xbox and all that it's gonna be fine um, not too much is changing a small I feel like only 20% of people are gonna be leaving switching over the PlayStation and there's still gonna be most people on Xbox and that's what I feel for the most part um, yeah so anyways guys thank you for watching this video my thoughts ideas on you know everything going on with competitive cod right now and just leave your comments um i want to see what you guys feel about this what do you think are you switching over do you have a playstation like all that stuff so make sure to leave a comment what you think don't forget to like this video and see ya